Luke, this is a really good example of a customer that sent in a Holden Commodore VZ instrument cluster and BCM. Um, they've done their homework. They've obviously been on the website because the faults come in with a copy of what needed to be sent in, which incorporates the cluster itself, the BCM and the key. Yeah, perfect example. Usually we don't need the cluster to test the BCM or vice versa. So when a job comes in like this, we're kind of scratching our heads going, what's the correlation? Customers actually got two faults in the vehicle. So as we know, VZ Commodores, they're getting on in years. Yep. Parts are getting hard to come by, whether it be secondhand or genuine. So repair tends to be a more viable option. BCM's here because the customer's logged a communication fault, and the cluster's here because the LCD in the middle has dropped out. Now, both of these are what we call prompt repair. So bring, bring in all the right components, we can test, identify the faults, and then turn around that quite quickly, yep. getting that car back on the road. Um, just a reminder, injectronics.com.au or those over in New Zealand.co.nz, check your website, look for the component that you're bringing in, and just make sure that all the components are here. This is a great great example of how a customer's done it right and this will be out the door before they know it. Absolutely, they've sped up the process because like I said there's no confusion about why we've got com both components because they filled in the fault report on the website. We've already got that information before the job actually gets here. Guys get it, they book it in, it goes to the bench, we know what we're looking for, we know why we've got two different components and we know the faults with them. Perfect repair. That's good. Cool, thanks Lynn. Thanks Luke.